In this video, we're going to use the Pixie data source plugin and Grafana's node graph panel to visualize all of my Kubernetes cluster's connections that are made to endpoints outside of the cluster. So first, what is Pixie? Pixie is an open source observability tool for Kubernetes applications. Pixie uses eBPF to automatically collect a lot of data out of the box, such as infrastructure and network metrics, application profiles, and full body requests. So here's what our final graph is gonna look like. So Pixie has traced connections between the pods in my cluster, and those you can see are here, and it's basically we've represented them as the namespace and then slash the pod name. So here you can see cube system, our operator, and all of these pods are making connections to outside addresses. So here you can see those. And if you hover over a edge between two nodes, you can get the number of kilobytes sent and received for that connection pair. So let's build this panel. So I've already got the Pixie um, plugin installed. And then I've also added the data source. And if you need to configure this, um, watch one of our videos or look at the link in the description below for instructions. Okay, so let's go to our dashboard. Let's create a new panel. So we're gonna make a node graph panel, create a node graph plugin. And we're gonna use the Pixie data source. I'm going to copy in this script. You can find a link for that in the description below. So let's run the script. Okay, and here you can see our output. This pixel script returns two tables. You can switch to table view and you can see it's got edges and nodes table. Um, the, node graph uh, the node graph panel expects these two tables. So for the nodes table, it just needs to have all of the nodes that are gonna be in the node graph with the ID and the title name. And here they match the title name as the ID. And then you need edges and um, here for the ID for the edge, I've just combined the source and target. Um, and then you can add main and secondary stats. So for us, we're using um, kilobytes sent and kilobytes received. So let's switch back to the table view. So we can quickly use the script to see which of our pods are connecting with endpoints outside of the cluster. To see more of what you can do with Pixie's Grafana data source plugin, be sure to check out our other videos in the Grafana playlist.